I suppose you think they're going to make up for everything, dear. I said sorry. Sorry doesn't get me my job back. Sorry doesn't make up for all the money that I'm going to be losing out on. It's not all about you, you know. Twice I have risked my job for you. Twice. You're not a superhero. It's not your job to protect me. I'm perfectly capable of looking after myself. Well, I'm not sure about that. Every time you interfere with my life, everything goes wrong. So just leave me alone. Norris said he saw you come in here. I need a word. Yeah, yeah, go on. Must be nice having a sister that works here. Well, she doesn't give me freebies, if that's what you mean. No, but I bet she can squeeze you in on a night like tonight, you know, Valentine's. And what am I going to do? Book a table, then sit on my own nice and big sad up. Ask my mum. Look, you've both been through a rough time recently. You could cheer each other up. No, no, no. I don't think so, Bethany. I mean, look, your mum is lovely, but I'm not in the right place for a relationship. Well, all right, I'm not asking you to marry her. You just take her out, have a laugh. And you might even enjoy yourself. He was. Face like a badly made meat and tatey pie. <laughs> Bit of a looker then. <laughs> he told me there and then that my love life would be complicated. I think that's one way of putting it. If you could bring just one of them back for one night, who would you pick? Brian? Well, he was definitely the best looking out of all of them. Lovely hair. Perfect teeth. Very manly. <laughs> Trouble is, if I brought him back, his mother Ivy had probably come with him. Well, like Princess Diana, three people in the marriage. Mm. Anyway, never mind about me. What about you and Craig? <sighs> Not great. You know, if I could turn the clock back, I'd do things differently. I'd be clear about what I wanted. I'd be honest. Compromise is the key to a good relationship. You have to try to meet in the middle. And if you can't, you might as well go your separate ways. All right, the piece is spoken for, but you can have some coleslaw if you like. Uh, no, I'm OK, thanks. Hi, um, I just wanted to say I hate it when we fall out. Me too, but I can't keep apologising forever. No, I know. Do you want to go out for a bit? I'll get my coat. Uh, no, it's okay, you're having your tea. Um, but we can meet up tomorrow if you want. We could go for lunch at the bistro and talk properly then. Yeah, good idea. All this arguing is making us dead miserable. And although I hate myself for saying it, I think it's make or break time for us. See you tomorrow. See ya. Bye.